But yeah, hey, thanks for joining the game. My name is Mitch Slack. Your name is Hardcore Slacker number 1573. Here we are. Yeah, we just finished whacking the Hellguard. Playing Doom. This is my real walkthrough of Doom. And we just finished whacking the Hellguard. Here we are in Vega Central Processing. And I've got a whopping 24 weapon points. Let's spend them right now. Let's max out a couple of weapons and then take them down to a lower level and get the mastery challenges. The weapons I've selected for this are... Heavy Assault Rifle, Micro Missiles, let's max that out right now. And Plasma Rifle, Heat Blast, let's max that out right now. Okay, so for both these weapons, we now have Mastery Challenges available. For Micro Missiles, it's funny how this disappears like that, even though you've got all of them. So what you have to do is this back out like this and then go back to it. There we go. There we go. There's the mastery challenge. This is poorly worded. A lot of people are confused about this, including myself. For micro missiles, to get bottomless missiles in order to fire missiles constantly out of the uh, heavy assault rifle, you have to stick four different demons in five seconds. Now, what does stick mean and what does different mean? I'll tell you. Okay, they could have left that different and it would have been uh, like explained a lot better. It's just stick any four enemies. All right. It doesn't they don't have to be different kinds of enemies? It could be four possessed. It could be four imps. It could be four anything. It could be uh, four different four different kinds of enemies. So they could have worded that a lot better. They could have left out different. What does stick mean? I'll show you right now. Let's use the uh, micro missiles. That's the wrong mod. Let's switch it over. Okay. So now we have micro missiles. We have six missiles. Okay. Now these stick to whatever you shoot them at. So fire it. Boom. See. That's not a good example. Let's see, go up against the wall or something. There we go. See how it sticks. So there you go. That's what stick means. Then you have to reload. Okay. So you could take like four possessed and shoot. Just shoot one each. Okay. And that's how you complete that mastery challenge. You have to do it within five seconds. And heat blast. Um, let's switch over. Heat blast, you have to fire the weapon in, in order to, to charge it up. If you look at the scope on the weapon, you see it's fully charged now, and then you can fire the heat blast. See how it charges up, and you fire the heat blast. Now, for this wet mastery challenge, you have to kill, make 20 multiple kills with the heat blast. That's it, and multiple kills just means two or more enemies. That's it, that's all. So, we're going to go down to our favorite mastery farming mission which is the second mission resource operations so let's go to the main menu mission select resource operations and let's get these mastery challenges yes it's another cheesy challenge cleanup run except this isn't a cleanup run this is like the both mastery challenges from scratch Okay, so this will be useful for, for anybody who wants to complete these mastery challenges. This is how you do it real easy. Okay. Let's just skip the opening here. Okay, I have the plasma rifle with stun bomb hooked up. That's very useful. In this opening area, there's lots of zombies that we can use to complete this challenge. Quiet, you were doing a walkthrough here. Okay, so first thing I want to do is kill the imps. There's four... Possessed and two imps. So I want to kill the imps just to get them out of the way. One imp is right there Another imp down here Now they're out of the way. Let's stun bomb these guys Switch over to the micro missiles one two three Four and that's challenge complete. That's all you have to do. That's it And we have a couple still alive here so we can start working on the heat blast Switch over to the heat blast. We have unlimited ammo. Also, uh, for this heat blast mastery challenge, something that's going to be really useful is the the rune that makes enemies stay in glory state or like uh, stagger state a lot longer. This one right here, dazed and confused, it's going to be extremely useful for this. All right, so dazed and confused hooked up. And for the heat blast to work, you have to like build it up. All right, and I turned down the sound too much. Okay, so it's 
get that guy into stagger state. And there we go. We got one count for our weapon mastery. Heated core. Yeah, that's the official name of that. Heated core. Let's take a look. Look, see here. Yeah, heated core. Now we have unlimited ammo because uh, the rich get richer rune. All right. So all we have to do is stay above 75 armor, and we could recharge our heat blast at will just by firing into the air. So that's that's the uh, the procedure: fire into the air and kill everything we see with the heat blast and try not to waste enemies so let's just uh, stagger that guy come over here there we got two now stagger this guy there's another guy down there wait for him to catch up there we go we got three Build it up. Rinse and repeat. And what will be your final moment? That's nice there, world. Olivia. We'll catch you later. <laughs> Sneezler. <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> okay. We got heat blast built up. Stagger this guy, let the other guy catch up here. Four. Build it up. Stagger that guy. There's another one over here. Let's get him activated by shooting with the pistol. There we go. Whoops. Staggered him. <laughs> Dang it. <laughs> okay, let's take a moment or two. This way, buddy. Atta boy, walk this way. And... There we go, we got five. We can build up the heat blast on this imp here that always spawns. Let's see if I can sucker this imp over in by this guy here. There we go, six. Get another imp here. How many do we have left here? I think we just got the one. Now he's all by his lonesome. Okay, so you go down. Let's keep our armor nice and fresh by grabbing some armor up here. There we go. So we have continue to have unlimited ammo. Build up the heat blast and continue. This area should be good for two. Blast right away, build up. Blast again. This lockdown should be good for a lot. We're at 12 now. 13. Ah, dang. Accidentally killed him. <laughs> Don't you hate that? Oh, my armor is running low, so I'm actually using ammo now. Here we go. 14. Got an imp here. Are you all by your lonesome? Yeah, you are. Demonic presence eliminated. Lockdown disengaged. Okay, let's fresh freshen up our armor by hitting up the secret over here. This is gonna be a little tricky. I find that doing double jump on these earlier levels, doing s platforming, is a little finicky. 
because you're used to like yeah 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 there we go. Down here should be some armor. Very good. Fresh armor. Build up the heat blast. And away we go. No, yeah, you're all by your lonesome. Come down this way. Too bad it doesn't have much of a range. Everybody's separated, okay. Yeah, see, it doesn't have much of a range. Will you guys nicely group together for me, please? There we go. <laughs> 18! Okay, we only need two more. How many left here? Are you all by your lonesome? You are, okay. Down you go. Go about the heat blast. Don't get killed by the moving container slag. Okay, so we only need two more. And the security officers four the zombies in there, that'll be supposed to be perfect. Nineteen. You there, get activated. Come on over, walk this way. Atta boy. And... There we go. Challenge complete. Heated core. So now... Um, we don't have to fire the weapon in order to charge up the heat blast. There's only one problem with this. It takes a while to recharge. So let's, let's just do an experiment here. See that? It builds up on its own. So, in a way, this is almost, almost useless because it takes just as long for it to recharge as it does for you to like fire the weapon and charge it like that. There is one thing though, it will recharge if you don't have the weapon equipped, but there's one, ca one catch, okay? The catch is, watch this, okay, when you fire it, see that little red circle there? That's the timeout before it starts recharging. If you switch to another weapon during that timeout, it won't recharge while your weapon is not equipped, okay? You have to wait until that little timeout um, stops. So let me demonstrate here. Um, fire it, switch to the other weapon, like Super Shotgun, and it takes about 10 seconds for it to fully recharge. So we're going to wait a bit here. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. It should be fully recharged now. Let's check it out. And it is not. You see that? Now it's going to recharge. So the trick is you have to wait until that little red circle, the little timeout circle has stopped. So let's do that this time. Boom, red circle, stop. Let's switch over to the super shotgun. Count. One thousand, two steamboat, three steamboat, four steamboat, five steamboat, six steamboat, seven steamboat, eight steamboat, nine steamboat, ten steamboat. Switch over, see it's fully recharged. You see that? So that's the key. You have to wait until that little red timeout circle stops and it actually starts recharging before you switch to another weapon. And then it will recharge while you're using your other weapon. Now, um, Having to wait, in a fast-paced game like this, having to wait for it to do that, I don't know, I just don't find that very useful. I, I just, I, I'm not going to sit there and fire the heat blast, wait till it stops, and then switch to another weapon. So, I don't know, I find the heat blast mastery challenge almost useless. Uh, micro-missiles, though. I mean, 
Endless micro micro missiles. Wow. Yeah. Does that sound like fun? <laughs> yeah, that's especially with unlimited ammo. So we're gonna take that into action in the next level. So we're done here. That's it. Both those mastery challenges complete. Let's go back to the game. Exit menu. And coming up next, Vega Central Processing. Two more levels and then the final big badass boss fight. And we're done. This game is done. That's it. Thanks a lot for watching. Coming up next, Vega Central Processing. And if you thought this video was remotely entertaining and or informative, please subscribe to my channel to get more videos like this. Hot up the press. Alright, see you next video.